hey, thanks for the gift. Wait a second, is this an empty box? How'd you know how much I love cardboard? Cardboard boxes are the most common packaging material in the world. They're made from tiny plant fibers that can be recycled again and again. Here at DEMCON, we love cardboard so much, we collect over 30,000 tons of it each year. We send this old cardboard to paper mills like this one. Each day, hundreds of bales of cardboard are dumped into this big blender called the hydropulper. Here, hot water and spinning blades break the cardboard down into a mushy liquid called pulp slurry. This slurry is piped into the pulping screen, where contaminants like rocks and staples are screened out. To purify the slurry even more, it's whirled around in cyclone separators that swirl away unwanted materials. At this point, we need to rough the plant fibers up a bit to help them stick together. So we run them through these metal brushes called refiners. Finally, the pulp gets sprayed onto a moving screen that carries it through a series of rollers and steam cans that squeeze and dry the water out. The finished paper is wound onto this jumbo roll at two and a half thousand feet per minute. When the roll is full, it weighs over 25 tons. And check this out, they can switch to a new roll without even stopping the machine. So now we have a giant roll of paper, but what about our box? Well, if you look closely at a piece of cardboard, you'll see that it's made from wavy and smooth pieces of paper that have been glued together in a corrugating machine, like this one. This is how we turn floppy paper into sturdy cardboard. We use other equipment to cut, fold, and glue this cardboard into all kinds of shapes, like this awesome box you got me. Boxes like this are used to ship over 90% of all products in the United States. And thanks to facilities like this one, our country recycles over 20 million tons of cardboard every year. Maybe with your help, we can recycle even more.